Hey guys, Lou here again. Going to talk a little bit about pistons and connecting rods real quick. D was a little concerned about orientation of the connecting rods and the piston and what have you. So, first thing is when you assemble your piston, the T slot right there goes opposite of the oil squirt hole. If you can see that right there, the oil squirt hole is right there in that shoulder. It's not focusing for me. Um, but uh, only one of these um, parts has the oil squirt hole drilled. You can look. See there's the hole right there in the bearing. So the oil squirt hole is always opposite of the T-slot. Okay? So then the orientation see how you have a, a narrow side and a big shoulder on the rod bearing the narrow side goes towards the nearest main bearing so in the engine you would have your three mains so the narrow side should be over here then on this one it's over here this one here and then the last one up here so the narrow part goes towards the nearest main bearing that allows I'll get the picture in the book same thing you can see that in the picture in the book here um, the narrow side goes to the nearest main here's the narrow here's the narrow and then they don't show the back one but uh, yeah so and then again here's the orientation and this is in the later service manual this is a reproduction of the original um, and this does not have the typographical error that's found in the uh, military technical manual so you can see in here you've got uh, your T slot and then your oil squirt okay and they're showing the camshaft for orientation so like I said the T slot side goes to the cam side of the engine and your oil squirt hole goes to the opposite side which will be um, the dipstick side so your cam is over here dipsticks over here so um, when you put it all together that's how it should go and then that will leave your little index mark on the top of the piston right there that'll leave that in uh, pointing forward in the engine block they'll point to the front of the engine so then this one that'd be this one's uh, number three rod so um, that's number four this is number three so you can see the small shoulder is going towards the middle main bearing then number two the small shoulder is going towards the middle main bearing. There's your oil squirt hole. And again, your indexing mark pointing to the front of the engine. And then your T-slot opposite of the oil squirt hole. Okay. And then again, number one, that narrow part going towards the front of the engine. Towards the... Uh, front main bearing There's your oil squirter Come over. There's your index pointing forward T-slot 
So that's how she goes. I, uh, I'm not putting them in right away today, but uh, that's how it'll be. So uh, um, I will post again when I do that and uh, when I'm actually putting them in. And so just a quick review. Narrow side towards a main bearing. Narrow side towards the main bearing. Narrow side towards the main bearing. Narrow side towards the main bearing. And uh, like the book says, the uh, T slot by the cam. So oriented in the engine, front of the engine. T slot is over by the cam, by the valves, and the oil squirt hole over on the dipstick side. And that is because as your engine turns, this is the thrust face and uh, needs that little extra squirt oil um, to help prevent wear. So I hope that helps and uh, good luck.